quarantine myself as uh, everybody should be right now. So I'm inside my office, as you can see. I'm usually walking downstairs and stuff, but I want to show you some stuff today, man. Today, the market's getting really crazy. I want to show you some strategies that we teach within MIC. Hopefully, it'll help you on your own trading. You guys that are listening to us right now, man. I mean, you, I, I get asked, you know, I get asked a ton of questions every single day from non-members, and I respond. I've been, I've been responding for years now. I don't mind at all. But I mean, dude, you guys are being cheap about the dumbest shit ever. You're going out and fucking spending this money on fucking movies, the clubs, but you won't fucking spend $180 to learn all this shit. And you're spending all your time asking me these questions when you should be inside MIC. I mean, that's that's the. I mean, that's the thing, man. I, I don't mind doing these things. I, I do it. I, I I understand some people can't afford it. I mean. Uh, some legitimate people really can't afford it, but if you can afford it and you're, you're just being cheap, that's on you, man. You, it's mostly ego. I'm telling you right now. I mean, I see all these guys. Oh, I've been training a long time. I've been, I don't need your help. But then they still ask me all these fucking questions there, and they're and they're cheap. They subscribe to other services, and they still ask me questions. I just don't fucking get it. I mean, just fucking pay your hundred eighty dollars, and then just fucking learn and actually start saving money. Because you, if you learn, if you are losing more than hundred eighty bucks, man. I, I just don't get it, man. You you rather fucking use that shit to to do what? To fucking go buy dinner for someone else or go to the club and make it rain like an idiot? But anyways, guys, um, I'm not here to do that. I'm, I'm here to try to help you figure out the market. So these markets are crazy, man. So first off, uh, we're, we're having a sale, guys. Um, <laughs> St. Patrick's Day. For all reasons. The reason we did that is because like, these times are crazy. So we just wanted a reason to, to do a sell for you. right? We wanted a reason for you guys to join and, and do a sell. Because, um, dude, these times are troubling, man. And the, the, the sooner you get the proper education, the, the sooner you start fucking not getting your butt whooped, man. I mean, I still get... I still get problems on my trades i mean that's that's all for mental reasons and stuff but i mean no one's a perfect trader man no one's uh if, if anybody tells you they don't fucking lose the hum the market is going to humble the fuck out of them the market is going to humble the fuck out of them so all right man let me let me put in some fantasy order trades and then we will begin that's some stupid ass trades i have open orders and shit yeah. um all right, let me do this. Cool. All right, guys. So we have a sale right now. Everybody text Tosh if you want the details on the sale itself, okay? So, man, look at these stocks, guys. I, I want to show you this. I mean, this you have the head of the fucking snake, which is Blue Apron, APRN. APRN is fucking just going ballistic, guys. Shit, man. This thing was a $2 stock the other day. Two fucking dollars. Now is that 15 bucks almost. Anybody is chasing, chasing, get their ass whipped. So the first rule that we talk about is the zombie rule. So zombie rules are on 1030 right here. So this was your chance to get the fuck out of Dodge. Get the fuck out. If you're short, get the fuck out. It's at 11 fucking dollars. Now it's at 15 bucks. So you just killed your account. You fight, you fight. It makes it look like it's going down. Then it, boom, it rips the fuck out of it, right? And so there's two ways to trade a zombie, man. This thing is, the VWAP of this thing is $12. It was much lower before. It's like around 11. So it was, I mean, much lower down here, right? It was down here, the VWAP. So this thing was like, shorts are upside down. So if you're a long bias trader, you see the situation, zombie time comes up, you can take a chance and go long. And it will spike up, right? Uh, if it doesn't, you set a stop and get the fuck out. But if you are a short seller, man, and you are upside down during a zombie out, get the fuck out, guys. I don't want to be cursing, but this this is the one thing I want you to not do. Stop fighting during the zombie time. You are dead meat. The VWAP is down here. The volume weighted average price. So short sellers are stuck. They're not only stuck from today. They're stuck from the previous days. The float of this sucker is like $8 million, but half of it is already... In the hands of institutions, and another thirty percent is in the hands of short sellers. And so, let me just do this real quick, guys. I'm gonna give you a free education for you guys here. So you type in, you go to Finviz, and then you can see this is the ape, blue apron, and then you take a look at the shares. 
float. So this is the number of shares that are that, that is allowed to be traded, and then but half of it is already owned by institutions. This is fucking locked up. Institutions ain't fucking dumping this shit. On top of that, you have a forty percent short short float. So basically, the the float is down to nothing. So the way you trade this, if you are a short seller, is this first day red, first day red. I'm just gonna wait. Until the first day is red and I fucking short. The same way with APT, CODX, all those plays, guys. There's no reason to cherry picking the top of these, okay? And if you are a long bias trader, boom. Zombie hour, perfect. Every time, 1030. And then take a look at this stock, WTRH. What the fuck is this stock? This stock even crazy as well. It came from 30 cents. And if you look this up, this is a sympathy play for a Blue Apron. And so this is why it went crazy. This sucker went crazy. Look at these charts. They're fucking almost identical. So this is what we're talking about as a sympathy. Sympathy, okay, guys? Sympathy. And we talk in, in, in MIC, we talk about how to trade these sympathies all the time. So I'm not going to get into it. We have videos too, but I think there's some on YouTube, but it's inside the chat room, okay? So... But that's not what we came here for. I want to talk about the first bounce. So I mean, let me let me let me first show you what the MIC chat room looks like. So this is the chat room we have. Uh, let me make it a little smaller. So pre-market, Alex does a watch list. A bunch of people do the watch list. You guys already know about the watch list. But what I want to show you is this, man. We pre-plan all these freaking trades, and we're. Oh shit! Can you hear me? Making sure. Can you guys hear me? Can you guys hear me? Making sure something something happened on my thing. Let me know if you can hear me so I can continue. Let me know if you can hear me. Uh, dude, my internet just went bonkers right now. Okay, thank you, thank you, okay. Yeah, my internet went, went bonkers, so okay. Uh, I, I wanted to, shoot, I just reset it, that's the problem, okay. So I wanna show you the chat room real quick. And then we'll start from there. So let's move this sucker over here so we can uh, have a better. So pre-market, let me go back all the way up. So this is all archived. So if you join as a member, an annual member, you get archives going back since the launch, two years worth of stuff. That's like a million posts already. Yeah, man, we teach you to trade. So I, I wanna show you the chat room because this is the difference between us and pretty much everybody else. These other guys are doing alerts. What they're, what they're doing is they're getting on the fucking microphone and pumping all this shit. So they get into the stock, they pump it up, they dump it to you. That, you what the fuck are you learning, guys? Seriously, I'm, I, I don't want to be cursing, but these times, we, I, I, I'm just furious at, at just some of these games and tactics people are, are, these guys are doing. They can't make money trading. And so they are sitting there pumping and dumping their position to you, okay? So... But what we do is we actually guide people. So let's take a look at the pre-market. Look what I did pre-market, guys. So blue aprons at 10 bucks. So what I do is this, dude. I'm, we are planning because I'm not going to chase this sucker up. It's already at 10 bucks. Look at this sucker, man. It's at $10. I'm not going to chase it. So what I'm doing is I'm presenting support points for balance. So if it ever crashes down hard, we are going to buy it. And sure enough, what did we do here? Okay, so take a look at this. Take a look at this. I posted, let me see. So so those are that we're talking about. So that's the first bounce, okay? So we, ta we teach people how to get these notches and all that. Harry makes a great video. And so when the time comes, we already prepared and we planned all this. And so I am not out here screaming on the microphone, bye, 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 because I really don't fucking know. So we show all our trades here. I post some of them on Twitter, but I don't, I don't post all of them, but we, we post pretty much all our trades here. So you see other people trade prints. So no one's actually pumping, but what we do is guiding people and saying, these are the areas of interest to watch, to look. And phone is all jacked up now. It just keeps pausing on me. Sorry, guys. See, there's just so much information here. So there we go. So here, here is the apron bounce points again. And then I actually executed. So here, here's one order from that. So this is the second bounce. We we did two. I did two long side bounces. The first. This was the second one. So this is straight off of the of the chart. This is a dead bottom at 1280. 
I mean, I only made it to 1357. I was at 14 bucks and stuff, but you know what, man? I, it, this is within a matter of seconds, right? Where's another one? So the, the before that, we had a, I had a good one too. Before that, I, so basically I had two bottom ticks, exact bottom ticks. So these are the things I traded today. Let me see what the hell I traded today. Oh yeah, here we go. So this is OPGN at the open, guys. This is at uh, 9.30, right at the open. So we were plotting, remember, the, remember those uh, support points charts that we talking about? Dude, I, I, I literally bottom ticked this right on the fucking penny, dude. <laughs> it went even below the tick. So what does this mean? I, I am not showing off, I'm not doing all this shit. I'm just trying to show you that this is what we do. We teach you to trade. While other people are screaming, bye, bye, bye. What the fuck are you learning from bye, bye, bye? Chase, hot keys, all this shit. We, we are out here giving the information so that you can fish on your own. Because you know what, man? At these turbulent, in these turbulent times, who the fuck can you trust except yourself? To be honest, you, you got these guys that, 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 that cannot make money trading. They are in a position and they're just pumping left and right. They're, they're going from low caps to large cap to ETFs to index funds. I mean, what, what the fuck are they learning? What, what, what are you learning? And so what we do is, I mean, these are the times that your education starts to pay off. Um, back in, back before when the markets were going up, like in the bull market, everybody was making money, man. You buy shit, it goes up. If you're wrong, you add more and it goes up. It never went down. So you got, you got lazy. People got lazy to learn. People got lazy to educate themselves. So now they're like, oh shit. So the coronavirus comes and everyone's panicking. The panic and the fear come from the unknown. The unknown comes from lack of education, being ignorant. You're, we are ignorant about the coronavirus. So we're freaking out. We're buying fucking toilet paper. That's how, that's how dumb our society is. So instead of, instead of educating ourselves on the coronavirus through scientists and not fucking the government, not the media who has, who, who cannot even do math. You know, these guys have not even fucking, they don't even know what the fuck the difference between a virus and a bacteria is, right? And so, I mean, most people don't. So maybe you should look up the difference between bacteria and a virus. That's, that's, that's the problem, right? So you're taking antibacterials, which is the um, penicillin and all that stuff, right? But antibiotics, that doesn't fucking work on the virus. But you have a lot of people that are dumb and they're taking antibiotics for all sorts of fucking shit. And that does not work. So basically, I'm just trying to tell you is this, man. Ignorance is the reason why people are fearful. And the same thing with the stock market. People are fucking afraid. They, they, they have no idea all these stocks. And so they're, they're, they're panicking. And, and what happens is this, man. During the times of panic, people get taken advantage of. You know, I don't, and so, especially even within your own community, man, I see these guys pumping shit on the fucking microphone and they're telling you how easy this is. Join my chat. It's fucking, I'm, I'm banking every day. I'm a fucking the best trader. And it's like, it's expected I'm making fucking a million dollars a year. I mean, fuck this shit, dude. That, that, that's, there's two types of people in the world, guys. Ones that have been humbled and ones that will be humbled. I've been fucking humbled a lot of times, dude. I am not the best trader. I got fucked so many fucking times. I, I was a victim when I started trading to these furus, and that's why I coined the term furu, a fake guru. You know, so, so I, I've been there. And so I humbled myself really quickly. And, but, but, you know, the, some of these guys like, you know, like, and now is the fucking time that they get raped. Now the markets are difficult. They're like, what the fuck? The market's so hard. The stock is not doing what I think it's going to do. No shit. Trading was never fucking easy, guys. You just got fucking lucky because of blind, dumb luck. You buy shit. You kept adding to it, adding to it, adding to it, and it worked out. It's, 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 like, it's like going to the casino. If you lose, you double the next hand. You keep doubling until eventually you, won't, you win. And it always works, right? If you have a big enough bankroll, it always works. You know when it doesn't work? The very last time, the very last time, that's when you blow up and you lose all your fucking money. You keep doing that same fucking double down strategy. It always works until the last time. And so we, we talk about this all the time. We in MIC have been planning and helping the members for these difficult times. Risk management process. Who the fuck talks about process and risk management except us? I don't see anybody the fucker talking about this shit. 
And, and now they're like, oh, uh, the reason you're losing is because uh, you didn't fucking buy fast enough when I announced my alert on the microphone. You should use a super hot key. Maybe buy this keyboard that, that is like uh, an optical feed so that the moment you push it, you are a nanosecond quicker than the next guy. Bull the bull fucking shit. So now is the time. Is, is either you're going to educate yourself or you are going to fucking die. That, that's the fucking bottom line. Do same thing with coronavirus. You are either going to educate yourself or the virus is going to fucking educate you. And then you get humbled the fuck up and you think coronavirus is not real. <coughs> the problem is, oh shit, I'm coughing, right? <coughs> I'm fucking coughing. It's fucking funny. So I'm, I mean, I'm telling you, man, I, I posted something on Twitter uh, uh, yesterday about calling it the Chinese virus. And I, I got so many fucking dumbass motherfuckers fucking trying to slam me because they're like, oh, I am anti-American. I'm not anti-American, motherfucker. I am a human being. I'm, I'm anti-bullying. I am anti-harassment. You, you know, it's a simple word that I just ask people not to use. Call it the Wuhan virus if you fucking want. But when you start labeling shit like an entire country and race of individuals, can you tell them Chinese? Can you tell them fucking Korean? Can you tell them Japanese? No, you cannot. When you look at me, I'm fucking, I am the Wuhan virus. I walk into a fucking restaurant, I cough, and everybody fucking clears out the way, which might be a good thing because then, you know, I, 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 there's no lines after me, right? But, yes, I got my tea. Chinese tea. No, this Japanese tea, green tea. <laughs> All, all I'm saying, guys, now is the time to humble up. Now is the time to show compassion to our, our fellow Americans. We are all Americans, guys. We are human. We are all American. We are not fucking anything else. And so I wanted to share this because, you know, this is, this is a sort of community that I love. Because in these times, I quarantine myself. Actually, fuck, I'm making... Uh, let's see, where is this guy? <laughs> Hold on, I'm placing some fucking orders. Alex is going to kill me. Alex is away right now. He's, he, he's sick. And I'm, I'm abusing the power. Sorry, man. I should be fucking trading like this. Hold on. <laughs> I, I, I'm done after this. I, 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 I don't really want to trade. Um, I stuck around for you guys, actually. That's my excuse, right? But uh, what was I saying, guys? This is the time, man, when fear comes. I don't look at fear as panic. I look at fear as opportunity. Uh, this is how the Warren Buffett's make the money, right? Fear, fear and greed is how he makes money. He, he plays off of other people's emotions. So when I see these stocks going crazy like this and people are panicking, I look at that as opportunity, not as fucking fear and panic because we prepared ourselves for this. Education is the key, guys. If ignorance comes from lack of knowledge of whatever subject matter you have, like people do not live in California, they're fearful of earthquakes. But people that live in California are like, dude, earthquakes are nothing. We get the fucking earthquakes all the fucking time. It, it, these houses are designed to withstand up to like an 8.8 .8 or 9 Richter scale um, earthquake, right? And so it's, it's nothing to me. So the, you know, whereas I'm from California, and the first time I moved to New York City, there was a blizzard. I'm fucking freaking out. You know why? Because I didn't have a coat on. I didn't have a jacket on. I'm fucking freezing. And it was the winter of the biggest snowstorm where they fucking actually snowed in the whole city. And so I was fearful. I didn't educate myself before I got to New York City about, about the proper gear to wear. I didn't even fucking have the earmuffs. All I came was like a fucking t-shirt like I usually do in California. And I got fucking... So I was like, I was afraid people would die. I turned on the TV. The TV guys were like... Uh, old people are dying. Uh, they're frozen to death. Uh, you know, it's the same thing with summer, right? Oh, fucking, you, 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 everything you hear is about negative, negative, but they don't tell you how to prevent yourself to educate yourself. You know, it's like old people will die. I'm so sorry, man. As compromised people will die. I, I'm a dumbass. I walk outside with a fucking t-shirt. I'm going to get hypothermia. I'm going to die. Same thing with fucking the coronavirus. But look at these times. I, I, the guys in MSA is great, man. We, we, we actually grew a lot because of people wanting to learn how to trade. Use this opportunity as you're quarantined or you're stuck at home, whatever, to learn and educate yourself, guys. I'm not fucking joking. This is your chance, your opportunity to fucking learn, to learn, to learn something new. I, I just fucking put in the work and learn. The worst thing you do, what are you going to do? Lose 180 fucking dollars? I mean... You're going to lose that more fucking by not joining MIC. I mean, I'm not saying MIC will fucking make you a billionaire. 
Because you know what, at the end of the day, I'm gonna tell you something, the strategies work. I just showed you the first balance strategy. I posted on Twitter. Harry is doing my strategy. He's fucking doing it. The people in him, hey guys, uh, can you, the, the viewers right now, who's in MIC? What do you guys think? The guys that are in MIC, just, just type what you think. I mean, this is your opportunity to slam, slam MIC, slam me. But you know, I'm, I'm very confident in what we do. I, I mean, oh shit, I'm gonna cover some more of this shit. <laughs> See, I'm very passionate about what I do, dude. I, I love trading. Trading, trading is, is you know, like, like Alex says, man, trade, trade, when I'm fucking feeling sad and stuff, uh, I, 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 I go into MIC, I help people like yesterday, I help people, it makes me feel fucking good. Like today, man, I, I wanted to do an IG live for you today. And so I did it because I'm seeing these markets, I'm seeing people getting killed, man. And so I'm seeing people do this. I'm seeing people fucking trying to cherry pick April, holy fuck, 18 fucking dollars, dude. You know what's going to happen, dude? Shorts are getting killed. Longs will get killed. Right now they're making money, but but the but the thing is, it's the FOMO. Now it isn't, people, oh, it's 18 bucks. I'm gonna get in and, and sell before 20. We know what's gonna happen. This stock started three days ago at $3. What is the risk to reward? So we wanna teach you guys process, guys. The, the, the goal of trading long-term as a viable solution for you to maybe replace one of your jobs eventually is education through consistency, through a process. So these are the words that we've actually, were the only ones I spoke of, but now everyone's copying, right? Because before they didn't really know what a process was. They were just fucking spitting out alerts. Most of these rooms are just alert based. They got one guy scanning for low float, looking for fucking shit that they can squeeze. And then the moment he goes, I'm, I bought this at this. See, I'm transparent. I told you what I bought. I didn't fucking lie. So what happens? 2,000 of sheep. He has like 2,000 members in his room. They're all chasing that shit. The moment that it fucking pops up, the moment it goes down a little bit, he will sell. And he goes, I sold. See, I'm transparent. I told you exactly what I'm going to do. I told you what exactly what I did. But he, doesn't, but he knows exactly what he's doing. He is picking a stock that has hardly any volume, super low float, using a thousand members. This does not take rocket science to figure out that that's exactly his fucking game plan, guys. And then what's going to happen is this, man. I see too many guys join our rooms and I got fucked over by these, these guys that are pumping shit by the furus, and I wish I joined MIC before. The reason why people don't respect us because they people do not like to work hard. They like to get rich quick, okay? And these rooms are the get rich quick motherfuckers, okay? And, and, and it attracts people. It, it fucking attracts people. I mean, I don't, I don't blame them, man. Like, fuck, everybody wants to get rich quick. But then, you know what, man? The true guys that join and learn for themselves you know, those are the guys that make it in the long run, guys. Take a look at all these messages from the guys in the room right now, man. They're all in my seat and they're still watching. They're still watching us. Even, even when I'm doing these, it's, it's you live and you breathe. Basically this, man, you surround yourself, guys. You have to surround yourself with the type of people you want to become, okay? Do you want to become like these fucking pumpers? Do you want to be friends with those fucking, those kinds of guys with mentality? It, it's basically like-minded people attracting other like-minded people. It's a law of attraction, man. I mean, I, 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 I am not here to attract fucking political motherfuckers, all this shit. I'm not a political guy. I have my own viewpoints just like everybody else. All I have, a, my viewpoints is on, on humanity. If, if, if fucking some, if, if Trump is harassing, I'm not, dude, you people have no idea what the fuck I'm voting for. This thing is fucking funny. They think I'm a slow flake, but I, I'm actually, dude, I supported Trump. <laughs> so that's the thing, but you know why I support people? I, I am not a fucking conservative. I'm not a liberal. I am an independent thinker. What I want to do is I think I vote for whoever is best in that position. So Hillary, Hillary was not the fucking good person. I supported Obama before that. I supported Clinton. I supported George Bush during 9-11. You see, so I am, I am basically supporting whoever is the best candidate at that time. And, the, and, and, and automatically, if you are calling people fucking snowflakes on that, you, I already know I don't want you in the room. And so the, being in the room is a privilege. We, we actually turn out a lot of people, man. If, because what, what happens is if one bad attitude gets put into a good... It, it's like a coronavirus, man. We quarantine ourselves. We don't want any fucking virus motherfuckers to come in and hurt our people, right? We've actually... But you know what, man? I keep an open mind. I've actually befriended a lot of original trolls. 
There's a lot of people in our room actually that says apologize me. I just got an apologies today. Let me fucking show you. Let me fucking show you. Oh, you can't. I'm gonna unscreen shot it. Some guy apologized. He's like, you don't. He just, they just come out of the blue. They, you know, I get this once in a while. They come out of the blue. They go, uh, you don't remember me, but last year I trolled you. I said all these things. I apologize to you, and and it's like, whoa. You know, there are people, and we actually have a video. Will Will used to troll me. <laughs> he called me a scam and all that. But you know what, man? I kept my cool. He came back, and now he's he's one of our best students, man. He's making videos for us on uh uh. uh P under PDT, under Patent Day Trader. Are you here, Will? You here, Will? So, yeah, Goose, Goose of the Villa just joined, right? How, how'd you, you just joined last week, Goose? Let me, uh, let me bring Goose on. I'll tell you exactly what's going on. He's a brand new member. I'm telling you, man, you, you need to quarantine yourself with, with people that you align with. That's the only way of success. And we started the TAP program. Hey, Goose. What's up, brother? What's up, man? Tell, tell the world who you are, where you're from, and all that good stuff. <laughs> from New York City. Um, I've, I've been laid off because of, oh, I, I'm sorry, I man. work restaurants. I joined on Friday. Best decision I ever made, man. I am learning so much. It's a real, real community. And I see it as a blessing. What's happening? What, um, what experience do you have in training before? Okay. You so I, for the last eight years, I would hit home runs, give it all back. Hit <laughs> home runs, give it all back. It's gambling, now, right? You're gambling. <laughs> now I'm understanding the singles. Why you got to hit singles. And like APRN fits a great strategy that you teach. I'm not going to say it. But a great strategy that you that, that you teach. And now I know why patience, bro. Patience, man. Just sit back, sit back. Like like you know, FOMO is something I always had. Friday, I mean Monday, Monday morning, bro. So um the market's down, what was it like two thousand points or whatever? Yeah. Then all of a sudden I'm like, what the fuck did I do, man? I lost my job, blah blah blah, this and that. Then it gets halted within ten seconds, right? Oh all yeah, the market's sudden, yeah. When chat came live, I had a sense of peace because you, Alex, everybody else was guiding, guiding what to do. And at the end of the day, bro, I'm so happy, man. All I've been doing is studying. Um, oh, b b by the way, man, the, the starter kit is gold, bro. The starter kit that Alex and uh, Taj put, put together, the phone call with the moderator, bro, the fact that Aloha, Taj, Guys, this place is gold. This is a family, man. I'm telling you, man. And I can't wait to, God willing, one day meet you at a at a meetup. After we uh, get unquarantined. <laughs> yeah, exactly. exactly. So, so did, you, did you find a tab? No, not, not yet. What I've been doing, honestly, is, first of all, you know, I had to, you know, get my shit together. Uh, yeah, yeah. For, for the future, because I, I had a three-month plan, you know, which basically was going to hit the books. This and that, and I, I'm I'm evaluating it out, and I think it's gonna it's gonna be it's gonna be a lot quicker, because honestly, the the, the room is gold, the room is gold. I already got, got you, a you. You nailed it though, man. You're talking about FOMO. I I love the fact that you said sit back and wait and pick your spots like a sniper, man. That's the key. <laughs> Dude, you said it. You said it pre market, bro. You you gave us APRN pre market. One of your strategies, and then and, and it's funny because 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 I was watching it and all of a sudden. Waiting for that for, for that thing to happen that you said. I don't want to give away your, your strategy. You know, <laughs> waiting for, for what it happened. Then boom, it it, it happens. Dude, it, it it happened, and you were not scared because you were prepared for it. Like, no, not not only that though, but everybody in the room, bro. Everybody in the room was like 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 giving you heads up and stuff like that. But the one thing you said, man, which I'm doing, man, and I've never done this before. Study, man. I, I I've seen the orientation video four times. <laughs> oh yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> You know, you know what, man? You're you're taking advantage of all the resources. That that's the thing people don't understand. You you have a resource of videos. You have resource of being able to talk to people after hours. This is twenty four seven chat room, right? Um, and and you're taking advantage of the moderator calls. I mean, that's that's the that's the beauty of it. Right but, but 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 also, bro, you know, this is why why I'm so happy with with, with the yearly, the archives. You can oh, go yeah. back to a certain date, and see and follow chat. And and you know it's it's to to me it's 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 like hands on like 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 
you know, you know, like 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 education is very important to strategies, the whole nine yards. But to go back and see what what the sentiment was, the emotions were at the time. I I, I find gold. I find gold, bro. That's awesome, man. I'm I'm so glad, man. And today is uh, so we have a bunch of webinar stuff. So last night was the large cap by Joe Kelly and Sam. Today is Wednesday, and it's oh, Tosh's that? day to do the new member. You got to go on that. It's, it's going to happen course. at, yeah, of 2 p.m. Uh, market time. Uh, and Thursday is the Aloha strategy. So we have a whole week of, of stuff, and that's the difference. We, we are here to educate people. That, that's why I'm so pissed at, at these guys that don't understand. It's all about education. It's not about just fucking gambling. Because what's going to happen is it's going to exactly happen. You're going to make, you're going to hit a home run. You're going to think, oh my God, thank you, this food room. Give it all fucking back. You're going to give it all fucking back. Give it all fucking back, bro. Then listen, also, when, when, um, when I hit you up, uh, when I first joined, I hit you up and you said something. You said, yo, dude, make all the webinars. All right? And at the time, I was like, oh, I got a job. Yada, yada, hold on, yada. no fucking excuses. There's no more excuses. I, I can hit the webinars. You know, if, if, awesome. somebody's tell, if somebody's telling you what to do, dude, I, I am grateful, bro. That's all I want to say, man. I'm grateful, bro. Thank you, man. And, and you know what? They're all recorded as well. So if you if you do miss, it's there. And I, I like the fact that I see you around um, after hours. That's a great resource. This this is a revolutionary new thing. It's like trading doesn't stop when the market stops. Education does not stop. Is it? Is but, a, you know, you know, but also everybody who who like is you know. I, I just I'm just I'm just gonna say this. You know what? We've all gone through though. See, I never understood what the other rules were doing until I, I joined MIC. I never understood how, how I was being taken advantage of, okay? And then some of these other rooms, they have these sales. Oh, join us for $400 for yearly, this and that. Of course they want you to join for $400 for yearly because they got you. They got you. Then they want you to buy like a, a $2,000 DVD and then a 500 bucks to meet the guy. <laughs> exactly. You know, and, and it's, it's like, you know, and, and also all the free stuff you have, Mo. The, the whole, I, I forgot the guy, I, I think uh, Hess is his name, I'm not sure, but the video he made on level two. Oh, okay. uh, Harry, 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 yeah. Harry, that, that fucking video is gold because everybody says, oh, level two for $2,000, I'll teach you level two. He hit it on the <laughs> nose, bro, when he said, yo, level two is a tool, a guide, not all and all. Correct. All right? You don't hear yeah. shit on the <clears throat> Yeah, because you know what happens? When you start trading, you think the level two is... Because you, you never had level two when you started trading. You were just looking at stuff on the online. and So this is the evolution of level two. So I'll tell you. So at first, if, you don't, if you're new to trading, you can just look up Yahoo. And those are all delayed quotes. Right. And so you're, I, was, I used to be trading off delayed quotes. I didn't know any better. And then I go, holy crap. There was fucking real-time quotes for, for a normal <laughs> guy. So I paid the low time, a uh, real time. And then next thing you know, I figured out level two. Like, holy shit. There's more than one pricing offer on the bid. Right, right. <laughs> and so, right. so this is so it's the leveling up, and and people think that level two is the god because they go, oh, I see all this stuff that no one sees, but then they don't realize that guys like me, the algos, can manipulate the level two. Right. I can, right. I, I can do, I can make you think a stock is weak just by fucking around with the bid and the offer. Right, right. But the real thing is the charts. So Harry is right. You use the level two as a guide. You start with the charts. And that's the line. So hopefully you're learning the line strategy that we talk about. And then right. when it comes to – the line is the area of interest. Because right. – uh, so from a line to line, in the middle, I call that noise. You're not going to stare like this in the level right. two. Four, we, we just what, I, what, I, what I've done before. I've done that before. And, and then you're like, yeah. you're like fucking mesmerized. You don't know what the hell you're doing. And you're, and you're like, well, yeah. why is it going back and forth? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And so that's the thing. So I, I look at level two in depth. When it comes to the area of interest, I want then I then I do this. <laughs> right, <laughs> but, but 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 also you you do have a, a video on level two. I haven't gotten into it yet because I'm following um, what I was told on what I should watch first. And correct, when I get correct. To, uh, I, I, I watch it. You know. Oh, this is all about leveling up properly, man. So I talk about and you're doing it great, man. You, you're 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 learning the foundation and the fundamentals. Do not rush this. That's that's the thing. It's like building a house. A lot, a lot of like when you build a house, the ugly work, the foundation, putting the right. cement on the floor, right? right? The framing is ugly. And no one really likes to do that. Everybody likes to go and pick the carpeting, the paint, the fixtures. But without a proper foundation, all that shit will crumble the moment an earthquake yeah. hits. 
but also like a, a guy who's been around for eight years and like I said, I would hit home runs and this and that. Yo, I got a lot of bad habits, bro. And and <laughs> I, I gotta get rid of these fucking bad habits, you know? And I mean when once I do go 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 to a live account, because I cause what I did was I closed E trade, I put it when when I joined MIC, I put that money away and I'm glad I did. Everything's put away. You know, and I wanna right. use the brokers, I wanna use everything. You know, even the the hard to the hard to borrows, there's a technique for it on how yeah. to do it. People don't know about this. You teach it, bro. You yep, the only yep. one to teach it, bro. You know, so you know, I'm I'm, I'm very excited, man, and 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 I'm glad to uh to be live with you. And let me That's tell you, awesome. everybody out there, don't fucking hesitate. Join MIC, bro. <laughs> Best decision you ever make, bro. This is a family, bro. A family. Hey, thanks, man. Thanks a lot. I hope you're doing okay during this. You quarantine yourself. How how's that <laughs> vibe over there? I, actually, actually, I'm, I'm at the house. I, I mean, I got no choice, man. But uh, listen, man, thank God financially I'm okay. The whole nine yards. Wait till it blows over. And then if I have to, if, you know, got to go back to, uh, to, to the three-month plan, I'll go back to the three-month plan, man. It's cool. Just just be positive and just learn as much as I can, man. Thanks, man. Hey, thanks. We'll see you in the thanks, roof. Man, I appreciate, all the, I appreciate your honesty there. All right. Thank you, bro. <laughs> Good to meet you, brother. Bye. Dude, that, that was awesome. That was, that was actually very unexpected. I didn't, I didn't know he was going to say all this stuff, but I appreciate the honesty. This is usually what I do, man. I, I, I have so much faith in our, in our education I, because, you know what, man, the, it's the people that make it. it that, that's the bottom line. The community is based upon the people in the room. And so I cannot do this alone. As you see, he's giving credit to everybody else. And that's the thing. I, most of these other places are like, oh, I am the best. Everyone learning from me. No, man. It's like, I am not the best. It's a community of people. Like, I'm not the best at everything. I just do what I do well, and, and other people do. So you find your niche, and then you help from other people. So that's why I love the community. And, and look, whenever I do these IG lives, the, the MIC guys come and listen. I mean, I, I love it. So I thank you guys. I just want to end this quick. So because I wanted to show the guys out there that's not in MIC what's it all about. And, and these troubling times, I'm going to tell you right now, the key is stick to your process. Nothing has changed. You know, I, I hear people wake up, they're scared, battle, so scared. What's going to happen? What's going to happen? What the fuck's going to happen? Recession. Same shit, man. You've been pre preparing yourself all this time. It's like the guys that go into Costco today. They're waiting five hours in line. But we've been prepping all our fucking time this year. We've been prepping before it even came. So when the time comes, it's time to execute. Do not be afraid. We've already been prepping for all this, guys. So do not be afraid. Process, process, risk management. We talk about risk management and process. You know, put your heart stops in. Do not be afraid. Take advantage of the tabs. Go on these webinars. The more you engulf yourself in the environment, the, the more, you know, you can do better because you're not fearful. Fear comes from ignorance. Ignorance is from lack of education. So educate yourself. And thanks, guys. I'll see you guys in the room. I don't want to keep it too long. So stay safe, everybody. Quarantine yourself and learn. <laughs> I'll see you guys. And today is a free webinar by Tosh. Tosh, post your information. It's gonna be it's gonna be on Tosh's Twitter. It's gonna be I'm gonna post it on my Twitter. It's gonna be also on uh, the IG of, of my investing club. So today at 2 p.m. is a free webinar. What Tosh does is gonna walk you through all this stuff. Um, it's gonna be happening today at 2 p.m. He's gonna give a link out on his Twitter. Okay, uh, Tosh's Twitter is gonna have the link. It's a webinar, so you can fully interact with him and everything. All right, guys. I'll see you guys later. Stay safe. Stay safe.